Hello again. Assalamu alaikum. This is Faisal. In this video, we will extend our previously developed project, School Management. We have done so far these four projects. Let me give you a simple brief. Number one is model, which maps the database into our project. We have talked it before. It is we are using entity framework here. Then we have created the manager class, student manager, which gets and sets and deletes uh, the data, uh, the, the student information from the database. These are the codes. Then we have called or created a client application, which is console application, which calls that manager and manages the database. We have also seen that. And number four, we have created a REST service and we had a controller which calls that manager and exposes this data as a XML through the web through the HTTP protocol in this video in this video series uh, we will create uh, the client application uh, which have the angular JS as a JavaScript framework and uh, it we will try to create a single page application so let's create it. To do that, right click to the school management, add new project. We will create a ASP.NET web application. We will name it accordingly. That web client is empty, remember, because we will uh, create is uh, as a uh, custom it according to our requirement next we need the angular js so install it right click manage nuget packages by default it will create some folders but we will modify that modify those re refactor those folders according to our need close so first of all delete this folder next inside of this scripts folder we will have generally two types of scripts number one our app specific scripts which we will code and the other one is vendor specific so we will create two folder first right click add folder app and again right click add folder name it as a vendor and according in inside of this vendor folder we will add the vendors scripts something like in this case angular js or in later if we need jquery or whatever knockout js or whatever if we need that so we again create another folder name it angular and press shift and select all these files right click cut and again right click and paste so we have moved we have moved all the scripts of the angular js into the angular folder in this way paste rebuild it okay next to uh, to create the files and folders we will need help of the angular seed you will see the angular seed folder here I have downloaded already the angular seed so and unzip that something like this so I will copy these all files 
right click copy and paste it inside of our app folder now we let's navigate to boost your development angular js gives you some pro some files and the codings we can change these later first our first task is to create a hello world of this angular js according to this structure it is defined a module something like my app so we'll add a index file right click add so we will define our whole application of the module my app next we need to add the scripts we will add all scripts here and above those we will add our angular specific files something like angular min and angular route so when the index.html loads it will also load this angular min and angular route min and it will also loads our these files I hope in my uh, provided videos uh, the links uh, I have to give you before you have seen what is the ng view and what are those if you have any problem to understand any topics here I have discussed or I have not discussed yet please feel free to comment or let me know I will give you the uh, according the links okay so we will add a href view1 and we will also add view2 so what I'm doing here I put two links if I click on the view1 it will uh, navigate me to the v1 page and similarly v uh, v2 uh, view page but where the views load it will load in here ng view so our uh, html is done now let's get back to app.js you can see the v1 and v2 it is saying when the url is default url slash v1 go to partials folder slash partial one dot html and that controller is my controller one similarly partial two my controller two and if none of this provided then it will go to the view one 